Welcome back, my YouTube family. If you're new here, I'm Rashid, and in today's video, I'll teach you how to make an automated data entry form in Excel, just like this. First, open Excel Workbook. Go to File, Save As, click on Browse, File Name to Data Entry Form, Save as Type to Excel Macro Enabled Workbook. Click on Save. Now simply enter your headers for data entry form. Now select rows in which we have data headers. Press Shift and enter these rows to select. Then drag down row to increase its row size. Under Home select Middle Align. Now adjust the size of columns so it looks like data entry form. Now select B3 cell, press Ctrl-1, select Simple Line under Style, Form Preset Select Outline, press OK. Now press F4. It will repeat previous task to apply border on cells. Now make headers font style to headings. Now copy the headers and paste below the form. Remove empty rows between headers. Now copy these headers and insert new sheet. Here press Ctrl Alt V and then from this pop window select Transpose. Rename sheet to database. Rename other sheet to form. Under insert shapes select rectangular shape. Write Submit within this button. And center and middle align this text. Select first row and merge cells. Control 1. Outline border. Go to view and uncheck grid lines. Now if you type information in form, it will be shown in below column. Now I want, if I press this button, this must show the database save into database sheet. Now go to developer tab, click record macro, name it to from submit. Record your macro. Now first go to database and add new row press control plus button on row number 2. Then go back to and copy this data. Go to database sheet, click on this rows number 2, press control alt T V and select values and transpose from this pop-up window. Press OK. Boom, your data is pasted here then clear all data fields from form. Then stop the macro. Now right, click on the Submit button, Assign Macro, select this macro and click OK. Now enter new record in this form. Press OK. 
and in row number 2 you can review this new record is added here.